LTC, we start with one of our chart. Okay, if you refer to our analysis, just I want to give a quick update. If you refer to my last analysis when the price was here, we mentioned about the possibility of the price to drop because we mentioned we can expect the price to drop because the way is moving. Okay. Anyway, we want to see how we can look for trade. In this case, we start with daily chart. As you can see, based on the daily chart, the price broke the previous stop. Now we want to see whether we can look for, I mean, we get a correction here for continuation or not, because we're looking, if we want to look for continuation, we need to get the correction. Okay, the question is how deep this one can be? Can we expect this one turn to at least similar to what we have here or any of this? Or we can expect to get a small correction for continuation. That's why if we want to look for trade, uh, based on daily chart, we don't have any trade set up for long term, but we want to see how we can trade this on lower time frame. Anyway, we move to forward chart. And based on forward chart, this is what we're looking for. If we get any trade setup, we'll take it. Okay, because we can expect this one turn to correction similar to any of this. That's why even in my last video when the price was here, we mentioned we can expect this, we get the correction similar to what we have here. Okay, now if we give for looking for this, any trade from here for buy, we will take it with the breakout of the previous stop. I mean, this stop we start to manage because as we can see, every time the price broke, the previous stop is start, previous stop is start to correct. Okay, now the question is how high it can go in terms of the ways moving within this. I mean, the way every, I mean, whether we call it a corrective or not, because we can see every time the price broke, the previous stop is start to correct. Anyway, we're looking for this. We want to see if we get any trades at all. We look for buy as a short term. Okay. And if I move to one hour chart, all right. Do we have any reversal point? If I put this one in relative to this, MACD for sure doesn't show us anything. And here also, we, I mean, based on the indicators, we don't see any information that the price can reverse from here. That means still we can expect this one tend to move similar to any of this for one more drop. That means still we can expect this one tend to a deeper correction. But anyway, we're looking for buy any reversal with a sharp move correction of like we look for the trade with the breakout of the previous stop. We start to manage. Still we're looking for continuation. Maybe we, this one is an example. If we get any opportunity similar to what we have here, we will take it. Okay, because if we move to daily chart. We are almost at the top. That's why if we want to look for buy based on lower time frame, we should have a trade setup and we consider it as a short term trade until the price broke this top. And then from there, we see how high, how sharp it can move. If it move as a sharp, it's good for us. But if the, this one continues a corrective, we need to be quite careful. That's why the reason we mentioned we need to consider it. I mean, any trade based on lower time frame, we should consider it as a short term. This is a, if we get, I mean, if the next move with the breakout of this turn to a corrective move. Okay. Anyway, we don't need to care about that. Right now we're looking at this and know if I get any reversal, we will take the trade similar to what we have here. Okay. In this case, right now we don't have any trade setup, but still we can expect for the price to drop a bit. But any reversal, if we get, we look for trade. And if I see any update, I will share. Thanks.